Alright guys, this is my interface. Um, start off, I'm starting with the boring crap because no one will watch it if I put it at the end. They'll all just close it after my interface. Um, editing the LUA on Lose Control. I'm adding... Uh, I have no idea what I'm actually adding. I think I'm adding the Pet Leap right now. I'll probably add Predatory Strikes, Shadow Dance, Unholy Frenzy, Hand of Sacrifice, uh, maybe Blazing Speed, things like that. Um, I, I have no idea. Um, to get the spell ID, just go on Wowhead, search the spell. Click on said spell, and in the God, what's it called address bar, it'll have the spell ID. It just says spell equals. Copy paste that. Throw it in the LUA folder with like a text editor. Put it in there as whatever you want it to be. I believe immunities come first, and you're done. Okay, um, my add-ons. You probably just saw a brief glimpse of them there. Lose control, obviously. I just edited that. Um, the rest are pretty much scripts. I've got. Move anything on for those ruins. It works just fine. You can do it with an add-on. You can do it with a script, but it's painful. Um, the first one I'm doing is the main menu bars. It's good for the griffins. And then um, for a death knight, it's the presences for your shapeshift bar. Druid, it would be the shapeshift bar. Rogues would be stealth. I have no idea what your class might have. Um, the second one's going to be the focus, target, and I'm not targeting anything. Normal casting bar. And it just scales them up just a little bit. I'll make them a little bit bigger, easier to see, um, a little bit more obvious. So when I hit it, they just grow a little bit in size. And I do move the other one later on in a different script um, from the normal one. That's the second one. The first two halves of it are for changing the nameplates to the class things. Um, you have to do them in order is why they're in my bars in that order and why I'm doing them in this order. This one is the player group indicator thing. If you're on a raid, it says party one at the top of your thing. Clicking it gets rid of it. Um, I think I had someone in group, it might have shown it, it might not have. Here's the very last one, this sets the class icons. Um, switching a weapon or any piece of gear on you will put it on yours, you don't have to reload UI to it, because then you'd have to put the script in again, which would be really annoying. Um, and it just puts everything in there. The last one is going to be to set all of the, my bottom action bar, the right action bar, the mini map, uh, and move the casting bar to like the middle and the top of my screen when I hit it. I don't know if I bounce anywhere near after this so you can see a casting bar doesn't really matter you can change those numbers to move it although you'd be playing with it for a while before you figured it out um, it's not exactly that easy that's a frame script script that will roughly put it where mine's at um, but it's really pointless because you can just do the move anywhere now um, they put it in default for the move anything at least for where you want to put those and the buffs on top are in there as well um, so you don't have to worry about that anymore uh, this is the buffs it changes my buff scale so they're not tiny up on the top anymore it makes them a little bit bigger um, and then I turn it on ultra I already hit that you can't see it um, but they were smaller I don't know why I wasn't on ultra anyway that's my interface